praise God, doing a lesson, and this came to, with, no, no, the Holy Ghost brought this, ain't no, the Holy Ghost brought this to, hallelujah, and thank God the Lord still, still teaching me and leading me, hallelujah, doing the law, the law, not the commandments, the law, You were punished if you didn't keep the law. Remember, yee! I love my God today. Remember, they were cursed with a curse because they robbed God and tithed and offering. They were cursed. There was punishment for not keeping the law. They were cursed with a curse. That was punishment for not keeping the law. And other things all through the Old Testament, they were punished. Shanda. My God. They really they got sold into slavery for not keeping the law and the commandments. You curse would have cursed this whole nation. There was punishment for not keeping the law. They got stoned to death for not keeping the law. Now in the New Testament, Christ ended the law in Christ, nor God, well, God the Father, nor the Son of God, Jesus Christ, nor the Holy Ghost, nor the his apostles, his ministers, his servants, his church, they will not stone you for not keeping the law. They won't stone you for not keeping the law. Ain't no punishment for not keeping the law. Now you break the commandments now, it parts me. And now it is a fire. They bear for all witness. And they were punished. Dead. Yeah. All glory to God. Hallelujah. This came in we Teaching the lesson. Hallelujah. They were punished. God ain't going to punish you for not keeping no law. God ain't going to curse you for not bringing no tithes and offering. God ain't going to curse you for not giving fruit fruit offering. But in the Old Testament, you were cursed. You were punished. You were killed. Praise God. God hit the disciples. They go, we're not going to stone you. We're not going to punish you. And you better be, you better be glad we in the New Testament too. God said you curse with a curse. You robbed this whole nation. That was in the Old Testament. Now you are cursed. Get me, get me, get me. Now you are cursed because you don't uh, follow Jesus. You refuse Christ. You are the curse of sin. Which the law and your offering the tithe couldn't take away. The priest couldn't take away. But Jesus. <laughs> On the law you were punished. God punished you. Moses then punished you, stoned you, killed you, called you didn't keep the law. There's a boy, boy got stoned to death for gathering sticks on the Sabbath day. He didn't have to do that. You, you're told, you are told, you are told, get everything together where you won't have to do none of that on the Sabbath day. But this clown gone. Do what he won't do. And Moses said, God, Lord, what should I do? The Lord said, kill him. 
Yeah. Jesus came working on Sabbath day. And they, they wanted to do something to him, but they couldn't do it. And Jesus never could deal nobody working on Sabbath day. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, Jesus don't punish you for not keeping the law. He only even command you to keep the law. But in the Old Testament, you'll be punished. And God will punish you too. You'll be cursed with a curse. And sold into slavery. Thank you for it. All glory to God. 